Hello everyone. Welcome to today's reading of the book Rich Dad Poor Dad. Let's continue. Ah, uh, where were we? He could not even pass on what he worked so hard for when he died. The rich don't do that. They work hard and pass it on their, pass it on to their children. Now the ones. I want to be free to travel the world and live in the lifestyle I love. I want to do, be young when I do this. I want to simply be free. I want to, I want to control over my time and my life. I want money to work for me. Those are my deep-seated emotional reasons. What are yours? If they are not strong enough, then the reality of the road ahead may be greater than your reasons. I have lost money and、uh, been set back many times, but it was the deep emotional reasons that kept me standing up and、uh, going forward. I wanted to be free by age. Forty, but it took me until I was forty-seven with many learning experiences along the way. As I said, I wish I could say it was easy. It wasn't. But it was wasn't hard either. But without a strong reason or purpose, anything in life is hard. If you do not have a strong reason, there is no sense reading. Future,、uh, further, it will sound like too much work. I choose daily, the power of choice. That is the main reason people want to live in a free country. We want the power to choose. Financially, with. Every dollar we get in our hands, we hold the power to choose our future to be rich, poor, or middle class. Our spending habits reflect who we are. Poor people simply have poor spending habits. The habit I had as a boy was that I loved playing Monopoly constantly. Nobody told me Monopoly was only for kids, so I just kept playing. Okay, that's three minutes up. I will stop the video here, and、uh, I'll probably continue reading for a little bit. I'll stop the video right here, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.